hello everyone. Um, this is the piece of equipment I was talking about in the last video that um, I want to say thanks to all my viewers and subscribers for helping me uh, pick this item up. Um, this was purchased through some AdSense revenue and what this is is a little portable um, grill here. It's uh, called the Optimus Hiker Plus Stove and it runs off of liquid gases. In fact here let me read you off some of the specs here. The fuel that this thing uses is um, white gas, gasoline, kerosene, diesel, jet fuel and others. And it's only a one burner. Um, weight is about 55 ounces so about three and a half pounds I think. Um, burn time about one and a half hours at maximum output and boil time as little as three and a half minutes depending on climate and altitude and this thing is a really slick little device from uh, the reviews that I've seen and uh, we've used it one other time we're gonna cook a meal up with it tonight but the main reason why we uh, wanted to get this is because with the Coleman two burner um, stove that we have, we can't regulate the heat. And this thing works really good at regulating the heat. So we can get a quick boil, we can take it all the way down to simmer really low and everything in between. So tonight I'm gonna kinda show you how this thing uh, operates, how you get it going, and just uh, show you how well it works. Give you a quick. All right guys, hopefully you can see this all right. Uh, please excuse the music in the background. They're having uh, a big hairband street dance type of thing going on down there. But anyways, uh, we're going to get this thing going here. Um, first, we, cl we clean the nozzle and the burner by kind of rubbing it through back and forth like this. There's a magnet down on this end down here that um, moves side to side and cleans out the burner. So it recommends that you clear the nozzle and the burner before you use it every time. And I poured a little bit of fuel in here, so I'll get this knob attached. Make sure it's all the way off first. And then let's see here, I'm gonna pump this. Uh, I made sure that there's no leaks in the system. You gotta make sure there's no leaks. Then I'm gonna give this thing a pump probably about um, 20, 25 times. about 35 times because um, I'm not sure how much fuel is in there not a whole lot it's not even half full so next step is I'm going to release a little bit of uh, fuel by turning the knob a little bit and it's going to drip down here and uh, go on to this cotton wick down here and I can see it a little bit when it comes down so there we go, a little bit of drip down there okay have that on there and then the next step is to light it up and then we'll let it kind of burn down until it's almost all burnt off there all that excess stuff and you need to pre-light it so you can get the wick going so when you open up the the valve here the, the, the fuel will um, ignite in, in vapor form so let me uh, light this up. This might take me a minute here. It's a little windy. Flip it around this way. Hopefully you guys can still see. Now this is only my second time doing this, so hopefully we'll get this lit here. There we go. It's going now. Let that wick burn down. It'll get kind of big here. And then after it starts petering out again, then I'm going to uh, turn the nozzle on. So I might uh, fast forward this a little bit. Never 
your face over the top of the soap you're using is to store up. That's out there because uh, you get a big flame on it. Bring your face off. So, yes, clean gas well, I'll put it off quicker than the kerosene I'm using here, but kerosene will work well, it's a longer drop here. Make sure that makes it nice and hot, so it's very cool. Hopefully, we won't blow out. There's some flames up. Alright, so now we're going. Can you hear that sound? Alright, I'm not sure if you guys can see that down there, but can you hear the sound? Well, that's what they're known for. Just busting away down there. Cooking up really good. But tonight we're going to have a ramen, ham, and pea uh, dish. Um, pretty easy, but looks pretty good, so we're going to give it a try and we'll show you kind of how we make that up tonight. 